renewable energies are booming as innovations at cost and deliver on promises of a clean energy future. American solar and wind generation breaks record and is integrated into national power grid without compromising reliability. This means that renewables are increasingly displacing dirty fossil fuels in electricity sector offering benefits of lower CO2 emissions and other type of pollutions. But not all energy sources marketed as renewables are environmental friendly. Here's what you should know about different types of renewable energy sources and how can you take advantages of these new technologies in your home. So guys, let's get started. Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, we will learn about renewable energies and its types. What is renewable energy? Renewable energy is defined as the energy that comes from sources that can be renewed in short time. It often referred to as a clean energy that is derived from renewable resources that are naturally replenished in human time frame. The energy is referred to as a clean energy and non-exhaustible that is sunlight or wind. So it can be replaced exhaustible fuels that are coal, oil, natural gases, etc. It includes sources such as sunlight, wind, rain, tides, waves and geothermal energy. The fossil fuels is constantly polluting the environment which results in global warming and climate change. Renewable energy contracts with fossil fuels which used up much faster than they are replenished. Although most renewable energy sources are sustainable and some are not. Renewable sources are used to produce power, heat and mechanical energy. The sources often provide energy in four key areas. They are power generation, air and water heating and cooling, transportation and rural energy services. About 20% of world's energy consumption by humanity comes from renewable sources including nearly 30% of electricity. About 18% of energy consumption is traditional biomass but this figure is declining. More than 4% of energy consumption is used for thermal energy from modern renewable energies such as solar water heater and more than 6% of electricity. This indicates that renewable energy is mainly considered as new technology although we are utilizing nature's power for heating, lightning and transportation for a long time. Types of renewable energies. The major types or sources of renewable energy are solar energy from sun, geothermal energy from heat inside the earth, wind energy, biomass energy from plants and hydropower or hydroelectric energy from flowing water. They are called as renewable energy sources because they are naturally replenished. Day after day, the sun shines plant grows, wind blows and river flows. Solar energy Solar energy is the most abundant renewable energy source. According to National Renewable Energy Laboratory, the amount of sun's energy that falls on earth in one hour is more than the energy used by the whole world in one year. So, this indicates that solar power is the energy from sun that converted into thermal or electrical energy. Solar energy is the cleanest and most abundant renewable energy resources available and the United States
as some of the richest solar resources in the world. Solar technologies can harness this energy for a variety of uses including generating electricity, providing lights or a comfortable interior environment, heating water for domestic, industrial or commercial use. From beginning, we are using solar energy to grow crops, dry fruits, foods and stay warm. In the present time, we use this energy to heat homes, produce electricity and warm the water. Solar energy is derived by capturing energy from sun rays and converting them into heat and electricity. There are three main ways to harness the solar energy and they are photovoltaics, solar heating and cooling and concentrating solar power. Photovoltaics generate electricity directly from sunlight via an electronic process and can be used to power anything from small electronics such as calculator or road sign up to homes and large commercial businesses. The solar cell present in photovoltaic system are responsible to directly control sunlight into electricity. Solar cells are made from silicon or other materials. Distributed solar system uses roof panels to generate electricity from home and companies. Solar farms have capability to power thousands of homes by concentrating light on solar cell covering a large area. Floating solar panels are used on surface of large water bodies. They are useful in areas where land is not available to place solar panels. Wind energy In past, wind energy was used to run windmills. Today, we turn turbine blades using same source. The energy of wind flow is utilized to run the turbine. Wind turbine are attached to electrical generator to produce electricity. Wind energy is also a form of solar energy. The wind is caused by temperature difference in atmosphere along with rotation of earth. Wind power or wind energy describes the process by which wind is used to generate mechanical power or electricity. Wind turbine converts kinetic energy in wind into mechanical power. This mechanical power can be used for specific task or can be converted into electricity by a generator after sun energy. This form of energy is utilized in most part of the world. Geothermal energy The core of earth is about as hot as the sun's surface. Heat is trapped beneath the earth crust from radioactive decay and during earth formation billions of years ago. Sometimes this heat comes out in form of volcanic eruptions. We can use this heat to produce steam. Water is sent below the earth through pipes Heat is transferred from earth crust to water which results in steam generation. Steam is collected at end of the pipe on earth's surface. This steam is used for power generation in steam turbine. Tidal energy Tidal energy is produced by surge of ocean water during rise and fall of tides. Tidal energy is a renewable source of energy. During 20th century, engineers developed way to use tidal movement to generate electricity in areas where there is a significant tidal range and the difference in area between high tide and low tide. All methods use special generators to convert tidal energy into electricity. It is a consistent form of renewable energy as 
we are not relying on factor that are essential for solar and wind energy the produced energy can be easily transferred as most of population lives near water bodies at the same time we need to keep system safe when huge waves are flowing in stormy weather it can also disturb marine life and delicate ecosystem in case of tidal barrage hydroelectric energy or hydroelectric power in renewable energy hydroelectric energy has largest share in most part of the world this energy is produced by using energy of fast moving water the force of that water is used to turn the turbine blades and electricity is generated using the power generator the world is already producing a huge amount of electricity with this said source this means it has a good potential to cover global energy needs both small as well as large scale production is flexible with water stream and large dams respectively for more detailed information about hydroelectric power plant watch the video link in the description box